As you can see, I'm a complete noob inside of the Beast Form Test Realm. I've done noob with Darkseid, but something I haven't done is noob with Gummy Baller. So that's exactly what I'm going to be doing in this video. And if you're wondering how I'm going to get the Gummy Baller as a noob, well, Ana gave me these buttons, where if I step on it, I get whatever tool it says. So it's right here, it says equip Gummy Baller, and I've got the Gummy Baller. So yeah, it's kind of overpowered. So really quick, let's test out how OP the Gummy Baller is. And bro, my capacity is full in one swing. Wow, that is insane. So right here, I think I should claim my hive, and let's hatch the bear bee. Let's hatch the digital bee. And lastly, let's hatch the basic bee. Oh, it hatched into a basic bee. Big surprise there. So yeah, let's see how fast all these bees can convert my pollen. Oh, and I guess bear bee still loads my entire backpack. And yeah, no better way to start a bee swarm video than to do some black bear quests. Let's see how fast I can complete some black bear quests using the gummy baller. 100 pollen from sunflower field. I don't think that's gonna be a problem. Yeah, and I fill up in one swing. Well, the problem with that is I'm gonna be filling up incredibly quick. So the only thing I'm gonna have to worry about upgrading in this video is my backpack. Not the tool, because I kind of have the best and most expensive tool in the game, but unfortunately the backpack is gonna be my downfall. And I literally just went over to Dandelion to collect some pollen, but I forgot I'm full. So yeah, let's just convert this really quick. There we go. And let's use the club dispenser, from which I get 600 honey, and let's see if I can buy a better backpack. And I can actually buy the jar for 650 honey, and from that I get 750 capacity. Let's go. If I go to the badges, Ana did give me some badges for free, so just because he did that, I'm just gonna claim them. It's not cheating if on that gave them to me, okay? So from that, I get a bit more capacity and some more critical power. It's gonna be very useful. So now let's test out how much pollen I get from one swing and dandelion. Bro, 800 pollen. Wow, that is actually insane. I literally fill up my entire backpack in one swing with this tool, or half of my backpack. Close enough, all right? Oh yeah, just so I suffer a bit less, I'm gonna use the get buffs button, which gives me tabby love, polar power, and science enhancement. It's only so I suffer a bit less. I'm still gonna suffer a lot in this video, trust me. All right, now you're stuck to black bear. 400 honey, thank you for that, sir. All I care about is your silver egg. Please give me it. Oh, puff shroom. Let's see if I can actually destroy it. Oh, well, not quite. I'm kind of full in three swings. Maybe in a future decade, I'll be able to kill puff shrooms, but for now, I'll have to focus on black bear, the man who makes me suffer. Oh, let's also go up here, get my free three micros, and also the free jelly that's up here. Wait, can I actually make this jump, please? Okay, I think I'm a little too short to jump up to Ana up there. But anyway, let's convert my pollen and give my jelly to basic bee. It became a cool bee. How cool. Wow. The coolest bee in the game is cool bee. Big surprise. Bran, I forgot to claim a black bear quest. And I'm also gonna do a few mother bear quests here and there. Because I do want to level up my bees quite a bit. I ain't trying to have level zero bees this whole game. Hello, new beekeeper. I'm mother bear. Pleased to meet you. Well, I'm not. Because I know you're gonna make me suffer, mother bear. And she's probably gonna grab me like my mom. Because I'm staying up past my bedtime to record this video. Respect the contribution. I right, let's feed one treat to my digital bee, and it became level 2, and the quest is complete. But next I need Black Bear's quest, which is Rider Quest, and let's also go ahead and turn Tree Tutorial into Mother Bear. Mrs. Give me honey. That is all I need. That is not enough honey. You're a scam. Five treats, bro. Where am I gonna get five treats? You only gave me three. Alright, well, good to know that Gummy Beller is good on all types of pollen, not just white. Fold up my backpack with red pollen in three swings as well. Kinda slay. I guess I'm gonna just feed all my treats to Bear B and it's level 2, and it's hella overpowered now. Oh, I just realized I have 150 tickets from the badges that I claimed. So I'm gonna do my next favorite thing, which is gambling. Now, Ana is doing this on purpose because he knows I have a severe gambling addiction, but let's buy three golden eggs, maybe I can get something good. Who knows? I know that 99% of the gamblers quit before they make it big, and I'm not gonna be that 99%. Diamond B from Gold Egg. Nice, wow. That is, a, that is a good start, and a buckle bee, that is a scam, and lastly, a bubble bee. Wow, how garbage. Only getting blue bees out here, dude. If you zoom into there, I already have the blue HQ unlocked with only six bees. How cursed. And next up, let's cop the backpack, which gives me even more capacity, and which makes me suffer a little less. There's also all these amulets on the ground, which, you know, I'm not gonna get them for now, because I'm not trying to cheat in this video. I'm trying to suffer as a legit noob. For your entertainment, I'm suffering. Ah, uh, Mr. Black Bear, give me your next quest. A thousand blue pollen. Alright, how much blue pollen do I get from Sunflower? Alright, not enough. I think my best bet is just gonna be to head down to Blue Flower. And Blue Flower is complete in two swings again. I'm not surprised that Gummy Baller is this OP. It's literally the most expensive tool in the game. When you have to give away five years of your life for a tool, you'd expect Gummy Balls to be that overpowered. Mr. Black Bear. When do I get my Silver Egg? Stop scamming me. Okay, Mushroom, Clover, and Blue Flower. I think this is where I get my Silver Egg. Alright, so Mushroom is done. Blue Flower is done. And Clover is not done, bruh. I'm just using a micro, I don't care. Okay, Clover is now done. Let's also get this jelly up here. I take what I can get. Let's use a blueberry dispenser. Thanks for the blueberries on it. And for the small amount of honey. Gonna be nice. And a free jelly. Slay. And let's also use a teleporter. I'm not sure where this goes. Oh, back to spawn. That's pretty convenient. And Mr. Black Bear, thank you for the silver egg. Finally, you have not scammed me. I mean, you did scam me. But at least I get something now. I'll attach the silver egg. And it's a shock bee. Nice. I'm gonna keep that for haste. 
because haste is pretty poggers. Next up, before I do any more quests, I want to get some more honey so I can buy the best backpack in the basic shop and buy the basic boots for more haste. Oh, it sparkles. This should be good for honey again. It actually gives quite a bit. I'm not even kidding. Some endgame idiot is boosting here. Can I steal some of your honey? Let's see how much I can steal from here. Bro, okay, I fill up in two swings in this field. Maybe I should do the rest of my grinding over in Clover. But anyway, I have 48,000 honey, so let's go ahead and run over to the basic shop where I can buy the canister, ignore the tools, and I can also not afford the basic boots. That is disappointing. I'm gonna fix that real quick. Okay, now I should be able to afford the boots. Let's go. I'm not saying let's go. I'm saying let's go. Get it? Because gummy baller. Goo. Goo balls. Okay, I'll stop. But look how fast I actually run now. This is kind of OP. But the next step to progress throughout the suffering is to buy some more eggs. I don't think I've bought a single basic egg from the basic egg shop or the egg dispenser. Same thing. So let's see how many I can afford. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, and I'm poor. Like Russia. Okay, anyway, let's keep this basic egg. Basic B. Basic B. Stop scammering me. Give me some. Give me a legendary. Okay, rascal. Basic B. Rascal B. And basic B. That is not it. But anyway, let's gamble over. Bro, stop giving me rascal bees. And bumble. All right. The game wants me to suffer even more. Makes sense. And I would go ahead and explore the Tembi area, but I'm kind of poor, so I'm gonna make a bunch of honey over in Clover, because this guy's boosting here. Just for the sake of this video being more entertaining, I'm gonna get the Tetra Mega Boost, which gives me a few buffs. And with the help of this not at all overpowered buff, I'm gonna progress throughout the game a little faster. So first up, let's cop the Mega Jug, which gives me even more capacity. And now I'm at a whole 562,000. And I'm gonna do a bit of grinding inside of Pineapple, and bro... I'm filling up way too quick. I mean, you might not notice a big difference at first, but I'm telling you, this is incredibly overpowered for a mid-game idiot like me. Because I'm definitely mid-game. Or should I call myself end-game because I have the gummy baller? Gummy balls do make you endgame. That is a fact. Let's try a gumdrop. Something that the gummy baller loves. If you didn't know, if you get this little gummy baller multiplier to 1000, it releases a big fat gummy ball, which is incredibly gooey across the field and makes you a bunch of honey. Alright, I filled up my backpack. Let's spend a ticket to instantly convert it. Oh, I can also claim a badge. Always nice. Anyway, let's now cop the compressor. Next backpack, which I can afford. And that brings me to 1.1 million capacity. I think the next best thing I can do is find some idiot boosting inside of some random field. And then I can steal their goo and their honey oh my gosh look at these rewards from the spider herbal pass five tickets very nice I i'm ready to seal this man's goo i do appreciate your goo sir it is very nice stealing your goo and look at look at how much honey i'm making dude like four thousand per second this is so good good thing he's a white hive too because he also needs goo but i'm stealing it from him bro look at the gummy ball bro it's growing these balls are becoming massive i love big ball oh my gosh and he spawned goo all over the field this is insane i bro look the ball popped I should make so much honey from this. Look, bro, I'm making 20,000 per second, huh? Yeah, I love goo balls. This is why goo ball is so overpowered. And then, and and I can keep growing this multiplier. Let's get it up to 1,000 again so I can make even more honey. All right, it is 700x, 800x, 900. And gummy ball pop, please. No, I'm out of capacity. Okay, I can use a micro. We're good. 999, and let's go. The gummy ball popped. Bro, oh my gosh. This is gonna be so much honey. And he even spawned the gummy ball thing, whatever it's called. Yo. Right, yeah. Gummy baller is incredibly overpowered, especially if you have people to steal goo from. Like, I can even claim this badge. Almost twice. Damn. 1.5 million pawn already from spider. Slay. Another goo ball. I love gooey balls in my field, especially when it makes me billions of honey. With the help of my newly acquired millions, let's see how fast my bees can convert my 1.1 million capacity. That gummy ball's got me. Incredibly quick, surprisingly. But I do have the science enhancement and the testral mecha boost, which does help quite a bit. And that's another million honey for me. Nice. And with my newly acquired riches, let's cop the pour the hive, which brings me to 6.3 million capacity. Bro, that is OP. The parachute, because why not? I'm rich. I can do whatever I want. And I can afford literally nothing else because I'm poor. Bro, I, I have to find someone to steal goo from now. Alright, I found an unpaid worker to give me goo. Yeah, so using the help of my unpaid worker with 50 honeybees, and, and, my, and with my 6.3 million capacity, I have a feeling I'm gonna make quite a bit of honey from this. Oh, some badges, which I definitely deserve. So the honey badge, and the goo badge, and the spider badge, which I got to hotshot. Slay. Look at this gummy ball becoming so thick. Oh my gosh. Alright, and it should pop any time, any minute now, any decade now. Let's go. It popped. And we are making a bunch of honey. I'm not surprised. Honey is OP. The most sane Beast Storm player ever, by the way. The statement from the most sane Beast Storm player ever, by the way. Yeah, so I'm gonna do a bit of off-camera grinding, and I'll see you guys whenever I get some more gummy balls and some more honey. Yeah, so getting all these gummy balls might take a bit of off-camera grinding, so I'm not gonna put you through the suffering. Alright, I did a bit of off-camera grinding, and as you can see, I have 17 million honey. So let's see how many basic eggs I can buy. So one, two, three, way too many to count. I'm just gonna buy enough to get 25 bees. Hopefully this should be enough. How many did 
did it even buy? 13. And I have? And I have 10 bees? Okay, it's not gonna be quite enough to get 25 bees, but it's gonna be close. Oh, wait, actually, maybe I'm wrong. I will actually have enough for 25 bees. Well, I guess I miscalculated a little. Anyway, stubborn bee, slay, rascal, I already have three of them. No, four of them. Okay, cool bee, I already have one. And lastly, a looker bee. Nice. Although, I only have 13 types of bees, and I would like to have access to the red cannon, so... Routes, please. Bugging is always the solution to everything. Yo, sparkles, give me jelly, please. Jelly? Royal jelly? Somewhere? No, I got scammed. I'm going back to spider to farm for some more honey, and to get some royal jellies from people giving me sprouts. Alright, I did a bit more off-camera grinding, and I got some royal jelly. So let's see. So I'm hoping this will be enough to get some more B-types to unlock the red cannon. Alright, hey, CB. Slay. What else can I get? Looker, I already have that exhausted. Nice. De De Debo. Brave. Bomber, which I skipped over. Commander. Slay. Demon. I only need five more B-types and have 30 jelly. So I need I need a new B-type every six jellies in order to succeed. That is not it. Please give me a new B-type. Bro, I'm getting scammed. Honeybee. Okay. And 13 jelly. That is not good. Not good for business. Riley. Another demon. Give me a new legendary, please. Okay, I got a, I got a frosty. And I got scammed. I have 23 out of 25 B-types. Bruh. What a scam. Well, I do have some badges I can claim, which is enough for another gold egg. So I'm hoping maybe I can get a legendary or a mythic from this. This will be insane. If I do, it'll be very good for me. Please, gambling addiction. Work out for once. Three, two, one. A, a line B. Let's go. I only need one more B-type. I'm thinking with my... I'm thinking I should also buy the hasty guard because why not? It's funny. And it also makes me incredibly hasty for obvious reasons. Oh, I can also get the honey badge for 10 tickets. And yo, sign spear. I kind of forgot you existed. What's up? Yeah, you know what? I'm, I ain't doing all that. Oh, bro. I just stepped on this button. I literally just made every single bee level 20 and gifted on accident. Oh my gosh. Noob with... So noob with gummy baller is no longer a noob. All right. That is incredibly interesting. I guess what more can I say? Oops. Huh. <laughs> I didn't mean to step on here. But what can you do? I think I should still unlock 25 bee types. Shouldn't be that difficult, right? Come on, bear beat. Bear beat, please give me jump. Please give me bear morph so I can jump up here. Please let me up here. Game, don't scam me, okay? I know I can actually make it up here if I try hard enough. If you put your all into it, you can do anything. Come on, let's make the fight. Please. Yes. The reason I'm trying to get up to the 15 bee area right here is to buy some royal jelly. So let's see how many I can actually buy. Okay, I can buy 10. Well, I can buy 40. Okay. 40 jellies in the dream. I'm thinking I just do until legendary and screw it, you know? The ultimate gamble ever. I gamble away my life savings for a new bee type. So what should I do, bro? Demon B, I don't care about you. Bro, no, why? Ah, uh, this game obviously hates me. But anyway, but I will have to get a bit more honey for a bit more royal jelly. 100,000 honey per second. Makes sense. All right, a bit more off-camera grinding later. I think I should be able to buy a bit more jelly. There we go. 30, bro. That's all I can afford after hours of grinding. Yeah, hours. That's definitely how long I've been playing. Please, I'm begging you, game. Do not scam me. I'm, I'm doing this on my legendary B. Shy B, let's go! And only 10 jelly. Oh my gosh. And now I can use the red cannon. Finally! And what I can also use is an instant taking further to get some honey, and so I can buy some more trash. And by trash, I mean I can buy the best method of transportation, the glider. Let's go. Or let's go, as I promised to say. And another hive slot, which I will probably never fill up. Actually, now that I think about it, I, I remember I have my extra base keg, which I bought on accident. So now let's put it in a new hive slot. Bro, that aim is crazy, bro. And I got a bumblebee. I'm replacing it. Give me a new legendary. Bro, scam. Anyway, noob with gummy baller is incredibly cursed. Anyway, I'm gonna do a bit more off-camera grinding grinding in Dandelion, and I'll see you guys whenever I get some more honey. All right, I did a bit of off-camera grinding, and as you can see, I got myself 10 quadrillion honey. So using that honey, I think I can just go over to the top shop. I should probably stop wasting the gumdrops that I also got from my off-camera grinding. So really quickly, let's just buy every single hype slot I can. Yeah, this is speedrunning B game right here. And yeah, there we go. I think this should be 50 hype slots. Yeah, 50 hype slots, bruh. Definitely fair. I definitely use an off-camera grinder. I'm macroed for a little bit, trust. But if you guys remember, I don't have any base kegs left. So I'm just gonna buy a few base kegs so I have enough to fill up my hive, and I'll see you whenever I'm done. Okay, I bought a few base kegs, and as you can see, I have 100,000 base kegs. I just didn't want to run out. I bought a few extra just in case. So yeah, let's hatch as many as I can. Oh wait, I got I got some gifted milk eggs too? Oh wow, how lucky of me. Kind of forgot I got these. I guess my luck just was really good when I was macroing. Oh, those are really good. Those bees seem kind of cool. I also got some gifted diamond eggs. Stop giving me diamond bees. I got four in a row. Oh, I also got some gifted gold eggs, and some normal myth eggs. I'm not sure why I would use normal over mythic, but who cares? This is B game. I do whatever I want. And as you can see, the B game suffering is over. Noob with Gummy Beller got 50 bees. A lot of them are mythics. And he also got 10 quadrillion honey. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot to claim a magic little. Let's do that real quick. Yeah, 10 quadrillion and 66 million. Seems legit. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video of me using Gummy Beller as a noob, drop like and sub. And tell me in the comments what you want me to do next in the test realm. And if you watched the entire video to then, tell me in the comments. I'll give you a heart. And yeah, I lost a lot of my sanity making this video. So I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.